Hello. In this video we're going to choose which page we display as our home page. We're going to make a page that displays our blog posts. We're going to make a navigation menu and we're going to position the menu below the header. So at the moment we don't have a nav bar either above or below the header here and that's what we want to do. We want a nav bar and we need some pages to to list in the nav bar. Now I've made five pages, I've already been through um, the basic process of making pages. So I've got to pages, we're going to view all pages this time and there's four pages and a special blog page. We're going to, I'm going to show you what, uh, why, is the, why that is special. So to make a nav bar we go to appearance, menus, and you've got to name your menu, pick a name for your menu. You can call it anything you want. Um, just something that we can that we'll know what it is, so we'll remember. Then once you've typed a name in there, click create menu. So now we've got a menu, but there's nothing inside it. But over here has appeared all the pages, a list of, a list of our pages. Now I want to add all of these pages to the menu. So click add to menu and they've been added over here but they're in the wrong order. So I want to start off with home at the very top, I want blog at the very bottom, um, I want services and about us, come to that's, that's the order I want them in. If you accidentally do that you'll get a drop down list so try and make sure that they, they all line up right so that's our menu so we've got to save the menu right now if you look at this up at the top here we've got edit menus and manage menus so now we're going to click manage menus and I'm going to both of these I've got two menus in this theme some themes will have one menu some will have two some might even have three um, but I'm going to put the menu in both of these locations just to see, just so you can see where they are. So I've put them both in the primary navigation menu, the secondary navigation. We'll save the changes and see where they've gone. So if we update the page, this is the primary on this particular theme, primary navigation. These are secondary navigation. I only want the bottom ones which are secondary navigation. So I'm going to turn off the top ones. So I'll just remove that one, save changes and if we go back to our page the top menu has disappeared. Now what we need to do is set the home page to be um, one particular page. So we need to go to settings, reading and this way it says front page displays at the moment it shows a list of blog posts the front we want the front page to show a particular page so I'll click a static page there then our front page wants to be home you could pick any one you want I just call it home so it's obvious which one it is um, and our blog posts page is going to be the page called blog then we save the changes just make sure that's worked See here at the moment that's a blog post, this is a blog post, but we've changed how the front page works, so click to go to the front page and there it's got home page, services, about us, contact us, and now this is the blog page. Now the blog page is made in a special way, excuse me, <coughs> the blog page is made in a special way. So to make a blog page what you do, we go to uh, pages. When you would add a new page, I've already got a blog page, so I'll show you how it's done. All you would do is you'd add a new page, you call the page blog, and you don't put any content inside it. But on a, this works on a Genesis, on the Genesis framework. It won't work on ordinary WordPress sites. It works on a Genesis-powered site. Um, over here, you just choose from the templates. You just choose blog. So all we've got is a page called blog. It's not a blog post. It's a page. So I'll make a page called blog, 
and set the template to blog. Click save and that page will now display um, your blog posts. So that's more or less all we need to do I think. I've made some slides so we don't forget just in case I forgot to tell you anything. <laughs> so this is what we did. We went to settings, reading and we set the front page we set it as a static the front page we picked out chose the page I, I named as home and the blogs page we used the blog page and this is how you made the blog page you make a new page call it blog and you set the template to blog but don't put any content inside the blog page this is how we made the menu appearance menus tick the boxes for the things we want in the menu click add to menu put some over here drag them up and down to be in the position you want them to be and then we've got to manage the location choose if you want your, uh, your menu to be in the secondary or primary position and then just choose the menu from the drop, that drop down list and that's it back to the beginning again well i think that's all we need to know that was a good video wasn't it surprised me how short that was um well Thanks for watching and bye for now.